In my experience, I think there are quite a number of different arguments for the existence of God. Let me just list some of them that I've defended in my work. One would be the contingency argument uh, that holds that God is the best explanation of why anything at all exists rather than nothing. A second would be the Kalam cosmological argument which argues that God is the best explanation for the origin of the universe at some time in the finite past. Um, God brought the universe into being from nothing. A third argument would be the design argument which holds that God is the best explanation for the remarkable fine-tuning of the initial conditions of the universe for intelligent life. Uh, another argument would be the moral argument that God is the best explanation for the existence of objective moral values and duties in the world. I would also think that the ontological argument for God's existence is a sound argument, which argues that the very possibility of God's existence implies his actuality and that therefore if God is even possible, it follows that God exists. And finally, as I said, I think we can know that God exists uh, through personally experiencing him as a kind of properly basic belief in the same way that I know that the external world exists or that the past is real, I can know that God exists in that same sort of uh, immediate non-inferential way. So that would just be a list of various arguments for God's existence that I think are sound and persuasive arguments and that I've defended in detail in my written work.